So you had a lot of private sessions lately, so. Ah, uh, I'm telling you. Yeah, Same and we, issues, and, ladies. Yeah, and we also printed, you know, we did the reprint on the, the myth of the vaginal orgasm, and we've had a lot of response to it. And Very in, positive. In, from men, too. I love no, you guys. Yes, yes. Thank you for jumping It takes jumping the pressure in. off of men and the dick and the, the erection and the ejaculation. This limited, limited view we have of what sex is has got to stop. We have this little sex square. <laughs> you know what I mean? And it's not if it right there. <laughs> Make it bigger. In your private sessions, you had two this week, and you, you yeah. were like, you kept on saying it's the same issues over and over it's again. Same. All right. What's the issue? She was expecting to, you know, rock into an orgasm. Okay. He could. Why couldn't she? They weren't doing direct. Different sex organs. Right. But they were doing the, the G spot, which is inside the vagina, which mm -hmm. is, you know, the sacred spot for the Tantra people. And. You know, she wasn't able to transfer her feeling for her clitoris to inside her vagina. Well, that's not how her nerve endings are in her, you know, clitoral structure. Come on. So we worked that through, and she was, what is it? They are just filled with joy when they finally, oh, I'm okay. I get it. I just had an yeah. orgasm. That's what it is. That's what it is. Yes, that's what it is. So it's like women don't know what an orgasm is. They don't know when they're experiencing it. The second woman had been having small orgasms. But not the big one. Well, so expectations. If you're expecting your orgasm to blow off the top of your head and bells ring and whistles and fireworks. And you cross the bridge. And you almost, <laughs> you almost pass out. From the extreme you pass pleasure. out, you squirt out of your pussy. <laughs> you God, <laughs> fart, you know, and the, and, the, and the vaginal muscles go, mang, 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 and mang, your mang. whole body convulses. And you shake like this. <laughs> so her expectation of orgasm was so out of whack that I'm watching her and I see her body go through the. You're having them. Yeah, I see You're the little the build right up now. and I, you know, the whole thing goes and then I see the, the autonomic. Um, contractions. Because an orgasm is uh, part of your autonomic nervous system. Yes. Which it's means it's a reflex. With both women, I use sexual fantasies. What fantasies did you give them? <laughs> come on, come on! That's what everyone wants to know. What <laughs> fantasies did you give them? So, one. What did you whisper oh, in there? Oh, no, no, I talk it. I talk it. Uh, when she opened up her legs and put her feet together in the uh -huh. goddess pose, she said, Oh, I feel so vulnerable. And this was a woman who could not barely touch herself. And every time I went to point something or, or show her something mm -hmm. with, on her vulva, she, she had all kinds of, you know, twitches and she really recoiled. Okay. So, vulnerableness. I get, oh, vulnerable. So I said, oh, God, here comes that tour bus again. I make a little extra money by letting them come in and look at my client. So if you'll just keep on going on with the session, and I'll see to it that they don't touch you. <laughs> and uh, they'll be gone in about five minutes or so. Oh. Then, then I say, Oh God, if the first tour, tour bus doesn't get it, this, here comes the second one. I promised them they can have some sex, so they're gonna wanna put it oh, in. Oh, I love it. They're gonna put it, they're gonna put it in. They're gonna just put it in real fast. And, and if there's one that I think looks unhealthy or diseased, I will get him out of the line. <laughs> what was the other one? Oh, look at you greedy. Cause I'm, I wanna know. We only have it's six the fuck minutes. Bar. We it's only the have fuck, six. It's the fuck bar fantasy. Go on. I actually wrote it up in one of my books, and I was trying to find it the other day to type <laughs> it out because I thought, I'll post this again I, because it's wonderful. The women are all, in, mm -hmm. uh, and this is a circular bar, Ooh. and we're all leaning over. It's like being in the stocks, and the bar comes to the edge of our... Like in colonial America where they put yes. you in the middle of the village square. So your butt is all hanging out, and you're standing there, and you're in your high heels, and the top part of your body is forward. And you're fastened down, so you're in the. So stocks. you're all exposed. Your ass. Yeah. So up pussy. above here is the bar. So some old boy comes in and he uh, unbuckles his belt and hauls out his big dick, spreads you, and puts it in, and orders a scotch on the rocks. Here's the good stuff. The women, we can all see each other's faces, and so we're signaling. Like oh, this, I love you know, this. If, if we, if there's a, if there's an awful one, we go. Oh, he sucks. God, I got horse cock again. You know, <laughs> oh, you poor darling. And then so someone's gonna, could, could someone bring the buzzer and have John bring in more lube? God, it's terrible. I need more lube. And we have this this beautiful black slave, or just he's absolutely built like mm, a everything. like pet pet. Oh, big pet pet's little. Pet pet but big. <laughs> but that's a perfect. Yes, he has a perfect body. 
Anyways, you know, this whole beautiful body. And he pushes the guy back and squirts him some lube and then lets him go back at it. You got me to tell my fantasy. <laughs> I'm good like that. I'm a lawyer. <laughs> oh, that was very sneaky. I, I know. And then people get mad at me because they're like, I can't believe I just got you to admit that. <laughs> Orgasm expectations. We just have to be more real. Keep it real. It's okay to have fantasies, but stay in your body. And it's not such a big deal. It feels good.